Hello guys, I am Muhammad Shahzad. Let's start another video. Uh, as you know that in my previous video, we saw how to set up uh, physical setup for VMware vMotion between these two exercise servers. So today we are going to uh, install one virtual machine and then we'll start and perform uh, VMware vMotion. Let's go first here. So what I did in free NAS, I have added uh, data stores. Which data store? Uh, this data store should be uh, on your free NAS, mounted in both these two uh, ESXi servers. So this should be there, this data store on both these. So we will install a VM on this data store, so then it can migrate up and down on this uh, ESXi or this ESXi. So let's go and install one uh, VM on uh, this one. I will just, I have a small, I downloaded a, a tiny Linux. It's a virtual machine, OVF from VMware. You can download it free. And you can perform test to migration and uh, while share powered off then or while uh, it's running uh, with the life. So I will go and just deploy a OVF template. So I'll choose Tiny Linux. It is here, VM, open, next. Okay, okay, here, next. Okay, I'll go here, you have choose, next. see and validate if this host is meeting the requirement for this OVF. Okay, seems like okay. Next, here you must choose NFS, free NAS, NFS data store, which we mounted on both ESXi servers. Next, okay, network card is this one. Okay, uh, next, same summary, finish. And it will take little time because it's a small 2GB uh, teeny virtual machine. So it will take a little time to complete it. OVF deployed here. We'll see when it is completed. Okay, so it's completed. If we come back here, down, here is our teeny uh, Linux VM. So let's migrate this one right now. This uh, uh, virtual machine we installed on this ESXi server and you can see here also three. I will try to migrate this one via vMotion to another one another server so I will choose only computer resource changed so we have installed this one on 3 so I'll bring it on 104 next next finish so see it's completed because it's a small one spend on your VM right now it came back on this one 104 and if we go on 104 in the VMs, you can see the tiny VM is here. We'll come back. This is shut down. I will do a live also. I'll power down. Power on. And let this machine up and running. Okay, we'll check. Okay, it's running now. So you can see it's running. We have some icons on the down. I'll close this one. Okay, this is a running machine and it's in right now sitting on this host 104. I'll migrate to 3 again. Okay, change computer resource. Next. 
again what if it's on three i'll go it's on four and i will go on three okay it's automatically selected three next while got destiny computer resource okay what is this the target host does not support virtual machine country hardware requirements okay just wait okay it's a uh, hundred dot two one two sorry this one migrate computer resource and three Okay. Shut down. Let's wait for one more time. The power off. Move it to. This one. Okay, now it's compatible. Next, finish. You know why this one is giving a problem? Because uh, while it's running, it's taking uh, you know uh, the virtual um, like the resources. So if you see, if you want a proper like this one is my HP server and this is Dell server. So uh, in corporate sector, we should have uh, both up and running, uh, like a same model, same thing. So then uh, there is no resource issues. So I have uh, shut it down from my, you know, four to from Dell to uh, this one uh, for live up and running machine. It didn't work. Let's let's do it here. So, because my two, both computers, uh, ESXi host have a different, different servers. So resources are like drivers and other things are different. So it's here now on three. Let's, let's do it again here. And let's check from HP to Dell server if it is, and if it can run or not. Okay, I will wait for full. came up okay this came up look like fine see here so let's migrate this one from 3 to 1 from 3 to 4 sorry from HP to the ESXi server it's okay next Okay, next, next, finish. And it's completed and it's migrated. Okay, let's try one more time from, uh, we did from three HP to Dell. Now let's see if Dell is keeping running and we'll see from Dell to back to HP. Migrate, it's live running. Right now it's on 104, which is my Dell host. Next. Okay, I will bring it into three. Our here is four Dell and three is my HP. Let's bring it back. Okay, seems like okay. Next. Next. Finish. Okay, it's moving. So no issues, uh, they are owing. maybe there is some uh, other resources issues on this server sometime. So that's why it gave us that error, but it is up and running. So this one was our uh, last video for this vMotion. Hopefully you like it, my both videos, physical setup and this vMotion. So basically the setup, we physically set this one. So all the VMs is moving from that channel now on uh, 
different one place to another. And uh, vMotion, another thing is because when you have a both in corporate sector, one server goes down, something happens. So VM is actually VM sitting on this free NAS. So you after that vMotion automatically this if this server goes down, this VM automatically will transfer to this one. This is called vMotion. So this is. Um, uh, completed over this video if you like my this video kindly like my channel and subscribe subscribe my channel hit the like button and uh, hit the bell icon for upcoming new videos thank you take care bye bye